Hi, in this session, we will see how to do the SAP implicit enhancement. So my business requirement is while creating the website folder with V01, when user enter the metal code, we have to check if metal is already sold or put on hold. So for that, in the metal master table Mara, there is a field MSTAE. That field we have to check. So where is that field? If you go to the MM02 transition code on the basic data one, this is the field X plant metal status. If you press F1 here, check the technical information. So Mara is the table and field is MSTAE. Okay, so this field is already contained Y1 or Y2, that is hold or sold. Okay, we have to give the error message that the material is already sold. Second, if the material is not sold, then allow system to create the sales order. But at the time of sale, when the order is getting saved, we have to set the escalator as sold so that same material cannot be used in other order. Okay, so what are the steps involved in this? First, we have to find out the program name where to do the validation. Second, we have to check the available implicit enhancement point. Third, we have to add our logic, activate it and test it. Okay, so for the SD model, in, for the SD model, there are commonly four routines are provided. That is MB45 ATZZ. This is for all the data declaration. MB45 AOZZ. It acts as a PBO. MB45 AIZZ. This routine acts for the PAI. And MB45 AFZZ. Does it contain? This contains all the form routines. Okay, those are the commonly used routine programs in SD. Earlier, this was used as a user exist, but now the user exit is absolute, so we can do the implicit enhancement in the same exit. Okay, so in in this uh, include, we'll do our implicit enhancement. Okay, now for that, go to SD thirty eight, enter. The program has MV45 AFZZ. On the source order, the line term table is VPAP. So if you see this include, this contain all the form routines. Okay, all the user exits. Now there is one form routine that is VPAP. User exits underscore move field to VPAP. So as soon as user enter the material code and press enter, this form routine get triggered. Okay. Now first we have to find out the implicit enhancement point. For that, click on this icon that is enhance. The implicit enhancement is given at the beginning and end of every form routine or program. Okay. After click on this, go to edit. Enhancement operation show implicit enhancement option. We can see the black dot line with the arrow. This means that we can create our enhancement option here. Okay, if you see, if you double click on the form routine at the bottom, also you will see one exit point given. Okay. So the implicit enhancement points are given at the starting and end of form routine. So now to create the implicit enhancement, right click here, create implementation. We want to add our code. Click on create enhancement implementation. Give the name as Z material underscore status underscore check Z material underscore status underscore check check material status 
give the description press enter give the package name save in the request now double click on this status so we can now we can see a block with enhancement and an enhancement is created now we have to add our logic here here we will be getting the line term data in the table vpap okay so first declare a work area for mara table data gs underscore mara type mara now if vpap matnar is not initial and if so what we have to do select single all from vpap into corresponding fields of gs underscore vpap sorry gs underscore mara where matnar equal to vpap matnar okay now before that also add and site decode equal to vs01 we want to do this only while getting the cells order okay if the matnar is not initial and the site decode is vs01 select the metal data from our table okay now if gs underscore mara which field that was ms tab tae is not initial okay if that is contain any data then give the error message as message material already sold oblique hold and the type of message will be error message okay so what you are, we have done here first we have added a work area of type mara that is mara then we have checked if the matnar is not initial and the site decode is va01 then for the current material select data from mara table into the work area and if mstae that is metal list is not initial give the error message activate the enhancement go back now as this material is already sold okay it is y1 we'll try to create the order by using the same material code just go back go to vs01 order type zor enter sold to party now i am entering the sold, uh, same material which is already sold as soon as i press enter you can see the error message is triggered material already sold oblique hold okay system will not allow us to create the material okay now if the material is not sold then what is our second requirement system should allow us to create the order but while saving change the material status okay so what we'll do we'll first change the status of this material in mm02 let me make it blank okay now to change the material status there is one buppy called buppy underscore material underscore save data okay this material we can use to change the status this buppy you can use to change the material status so here at the header level we have to pass material code in the film material and in the client data there is one field called as purchase status pur underscore status 
derivative or, or status and also the valid form okay so we will be using this uh, buppy in our program okay so what we will do now we will create one more implicit enhancement in the same program okay Now, okay. let's get uh, go to again mv45 afzz. We have done one impl uh, one implicit enhancement. Now we'll do the second one. Now here, there is a exit q1 which get triggered at time of save. Let me check that exit. Hmm. So this is a user exit. User exit underscore save underscore document. Okay. So here. We will create one more enhancement point, implicit enhancement. So again, go to enhance. Edit. Show implicit enhancement. So here again we can see, at the beginning, there is an enhancement option as Q1 okay with with this black arrow again right click here go to enhancement operation create now here we can use the same enhancement operation okay we will not create a new one again what we'll do we'll use the same one z metal underscore status underscore check okay now we have to add our code here for changing the material status now first as i told you we require the header data and the client data okay as per the buppy importing parameter type now the material code here comes in the table xvbap so Look at xvbap end loop. In my scenario, I am assuming that I am having only one metal code. Okay, so that's why I am adding exit here. Now look at xvbap. Now what we have to do? Go to pattern. In the call function, enter our puppy that is puppy underscore material underscore save data now pass the required data so what data we have to pass at the header level that is head data material we have to pass material code so here in x vbap matnar we have to pass and we want to save the status as y1 that is sold and the valid form today's date okay and this is the client x just for the same field make as x and call that buppy here we have to pass that that is the head data uncomment this here add client data and client data x save check and activate this may take some time okay so we have to do this one more point i also want to add one exit here at the vpap here also i want to add just exit point okay now activate the announcement now what we have done while creating the order system will first check if the metal is already sold then it will give error message if it is not sold the system will allow to create the order and while saving it will change the status okay 
now deactivate it go back go to mm03 now current state is blank okay now go to va01 or type z or enter soul to party enter the metal code now system is not given any error message okay double click here to add the pricing condition save the record the order 98 has been saved now again go to m03 you can see the store is changed to y1 that is sold that is valid from today okay now the store is sold now create one more order with the same type see the error message this means that both the implicit announcement which you have done are working properly to meet our business requirement okay so in this way we have finished the session of implementing the implicit announcement thank you